let me do this real quick and we will start the game. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Oh. Okay, time for mic check. Quick. to the stream. My name is Hannah Powers, the HP 600, or you can call me Hannah. <laughs> and today we are playing some Batman Telltale series, and we are playing episode 4 today. So yeah. Um, but yeah, we're almost done with the season. Wow. He Hello, Fire Crystal. Welcome to the stream. Anyway, um, what happened last time? Um, last time, uh, we found out who, uh, is the leader of the Children of, Ar of Arkham. It is Vicky Vale, the reporter. Shocking, right? So, yeah. Like, before, uh, we found out, she, w she was acting very suspicious and, like, always get into our business and everything, which is pretty annoying. And, um, what happened? What else happened? Um, Harvey was going crazy because he is known as Two-Face. So, yeah. And, um, we are in a relationship with, uh, Selena Kyle, who is Catwoman. So, yeah. So... Let's get started. Make sure I'm on. Yep, Twitch. Yes, I am doing a YouTube walkthrough right now on my YouTube channel. Classic. Hmm. 
Yes, I just did that. This link will get you to the link. Let's get this link will get you to my YouTube channel. So how are you guys doing today and where are you guys tuning in from? Previously on Batman the Telltale series. Why did you do it? Harvey needed you. Why save me? I haven't actually seen it yet. You've had me wrapped up this whole time. <laughs> Numbed beyond belief. Maybe it's not that bad. Our stock is tanking. The board is losing confidence. Mm -hmm. Wayne Enterprises needs a new face. Oh yeah, I forgot. Um, they Oswald are replacing Cobb us uh, with um, Oswald Cobblepot, here, who is the Penguin. The on the new Bat -Tech. So yeah, we're getting replaced. What I can from the lab. You're a good man, Bruce. Because most people don't trust us. Because of, you know, um, the Waynes uh, were um, cr criminals. Well, Please, especially uh, I, I uh, Bruce's I... uh, Bruce? father, Thomas Wayne. <laughs> you should come stay with me. I'll think about it. Dropped your pen. That's not. <laughs> yep. She is the children of Arkham. She, she is nicknamed a uh, Lady Arkham. I think it's time you knew my real name. I am Lady Arkham. She was Lady Arkham. Yeah. I didn't like her. Okay, I'm up. I have no idea why I, I liked her, so. For Christ's sake, put some clothes on. Doctor's making the rounds soon. Doctor? What doctor? Oh, Bruce. Arkham Asylum. This can't be happening. Sorry, guys. Broken wall. 
Look at it. Looks like someone was angry. Lovely. Is that my blood? God, I hope it's mine. Gotta be teasing. You settled? Good. Anything you need? Water, piss, rat poison? I've been asked for rope before. Not really allowed to give it out. Of course, I could make an exception for you. You can tell me why I'm in Arkham Asylum for a start. What? Rich boy doesn't remember? Oswald Cobblepot? You beat him to a bloody pulp. Nearly killed him. Landed you here. Any of this ringing a bell? Might as well get comfortable. This is your home now. Time to meet your neighbors. <laughs> As you were. Oh, my. You look just like him. Your father ever tell you about me? How he sent me here? Left me to rot in this goddamn hellhole? Somebody's gotta pay for that. Let's see. I hope to God there is a hell. I want your daddy to see what I do to you. I am so sick of everyone blaming me for what my father did. I'm yeah, not like, him. Hurting yeah, me like, it, does not nothing. His fault. Maybe not. But you're the next he best didn't even thing, know. Wayne. It's not his fault. I know who buddy. that is. Oh, buddy. Are you okay? You guys should know who this is, you don't too. look so grand. More like the opposite. What would that be? I... Thank you. I appreciate the help. You're welcome. If we don't look out for each other, who will? You guys right? should know. What is going on in here? It's like I told you, Doctor. These creeps. And you guys should know guy. who, well, who, who uh, he's going you? to be later on. Of course not. But I'm not. I'm not gonna say it for spoilers. The new guy is tougher than he looks. Right, buddy? Bruce, is that really what happened? Oh, what? Go on, tell her. <clears throat> I don't really know what happened. This is all a blur. Seems like you could have experienced another psychotic episode. We'll need to keep an eye on that. The orderly that was here before took money from these men and let them into my room. He gave them a taser. I knew that you coming to Arkham could cause some excitement, but I didn't mm. expect it to happen so fast. I'll do my best to keep you safe, but I need you to be careful. <sighs> Us nice yeah. guys gotta stick together. Am oh I right? Come to me if anything happens. Don't worry. I'm always careful. And you seem to be able know. to defend yourself quite well. Sorry about that, Still, you guys. Better to play it safe. You were lucky. Help came so quickly. Hey, I'm just looking out for the new guy. I'm Dr. Joan Leland, by the way. Head of psychiatry. I'll be overseeing your case personally. Okay, we'll get you transferred to a new room, Bruce. One that doesn't have your... blood all over it. For now, follow me. How did our blood again that bad? Me? Did they do something? <laughs> He's never given his name out to anybody. What? You just call him John Doe. Bingo. <laughs> John Doe. John is one of our most improved patients. He's been with us for quite some time. I'm sure he'd be willing to show you around. Right, John? Oh, yeah. 
I'll show him the whole nine yards. <laughs> I think it would be best if you stayed by his side. For There's not enough black tiles, you hear me? There's too many white tiles! <laughs> And so always. The rich room. You know, Doc, our last session was so enlightening. That's good to hear. Your next evaluation is in a few weeks. I have a feeling something's gonna grab yeah, me. Start and start and even though I played you. this before. Oh. <laughs> Every day, Doctor. I just Every kind day. of God. I can't taste it! Ah. I wanna taste! <laughs> scared me. Gotta be more careful, Bruce. I knew it. Some of these guys bite. When he said he wants a taste, sounds like a cannibal. Uh, that's disturbing. You remember the first time you let me into the rec room, Dr. Leland? <laughs> how could I forget? You had to teach me how to play checkers. Oh, yes, well. Okay. Betting patients to swallow game pieces isn't really how that's supposed to be played. <laughs> no, no, you, you, you need to let me go. I have to warn the president. You're trying to kill me. You don't know the president. What? <laughs> they don't like it when president. you try to use the phone. That's because phones are for staff use only. No exceptions. <laughs> Didn't stop that guy from trying. <laughs> Such persistence. No, Run the the president. Stop. In this game. I'll come by to check on you two later. Don't worry about us, Dr. Leland. I'm gonna take good care of him. Oh, man. Welcome to Arkham Asylum. <laughs> Arkham Asylum. Believe it or not, That's some where of we these are. people That's are where crazy. Harvey <laughs> sent us. But everyone's friendly, mostly. Keyword, mostly. I watch yourself around those two. Not a big fan of strangers. And just a little bit, you know. Prone to outbursts of violence. What did they do? This is Arkham, Bruce! Youth, that sick little imagination of yours. Murder, mayhem, carnage. Let's see. On the couch, that's St. Louis. <laughs> his favorite show's on. Never misses it. That's his favorite All show. Right. Weird. Commercial break. Dead up. There is the remote. One of the orderlies must have taken it. Never fear, though. I'll go ask Leland. She likes me. I oh, bet. I almost forgot. Here. Yeah. What is this? Ooh, a key. Key to what exactly? Okay. What's in here? Not oh. the right key for this. I forgot. I forgot how this goes. I haven't played this in a long time. Where does it go to? Cookie crumbs. That's it. Oh yeah. <laughs> the gate. Yes, I cracked it. <laughs> Lewis, I swear if you don't shut up, I will come. Uh, someone's stereo is real loud. They hear in the background. Hmm. Well, this key doesn't fit. I can't. What the do hell it. is it for? Not 
you. Sorry, sorry. It's just, it's his, it's his voice. It's driving me nuts. But you're already nuts. Batman really did a number on this guy. Just oh man. Me. Oh god. I don't even remember that. I don't even remember that guy was there. Better get away from him, because we just fought him. Wait, that's the move you're going to make? Huh? Victor says. I remember him. I remember uh, fr Bruce him from uh, Injustice 2. You've got quite a too. reputation around here. Taking your enemies out to stay on top. I like your style. Oh no. Ah, oh, he's back. Hey there, buddy boy. You missed me? I missed you. Sure. However, the threat remains. The children of Arkham are still out there, and I will not rest until these streets are safe and firmly under my control. And Never anything good on, is there? Tried it though, didn't you? <laughs> that's, that's hilarious. <laughs> My enforcement squad has already seen great success. They stopped a massive attack being organized out of a local Sky Train depot. Politicians usually bore me to tears, but this one, this one, has become a lot more interesting lately. In my Gotham, no one's above the law, including Bruce Wayne. After his vicious attack on Oswald Cobblepot, I well, had Mr. Me. Wayne committed to Arkham Asylum, Vicky where made I do hope that. he'll receive the treatment he so desperately needs. <laughs> Double crossing, two faced. I thought you and the uh, mayor were friends. I mean, you were supporting his campaign. I saw all sorts of photos uh, of the two of you together. We used Harvey to, but he betrayed, betrayed me as well. I can't believe he's the one who put me here. Sounds like you need better friends. Slim pickings oh, boy. around here, though. I've looked. In which Mayor Dent announced the creation of a special enforcement squad under his direct command to combat an imminent threat from the children of Arkham. It's okay, Bruce. Rest assured, we will find these terrorists. Their stockpile of drugs and their leader, this Lady Arkham, before they Vicky. can strike again. Vicky Vale. Now, this the is no good, good reporter. Mayor Probably was never a reporter. Freaky drug Maybe she was pretending. I'm gonna find your drugs. I'm going to expose your corruption. <laughs> this isn't a joke. Their war is going to destroy Gotham. That's what makes it so funny. All those people caught in the middle. Tragically, there's yeah. still no sign of Gotham Gazette reporter Vicky Vale after her mysterious disappearance earlier this week. She's not missing. Very she's Lady Arkham. I think we both know she's quite the uh, lady. Right, Bruce? Wait. You know that Vicky is. Tell me what you know. You want to find Vicky and her drugs, huh? Can oh, so he knows. Just like you got your revenge on Cobblepot. Publicly and dramatically, something entertaining for these newscasters to talk about. I'll find a way to take her down. But I'm doing it my way. Quietly. Could be interesting. Little Bruce lurking in the shadows. No, I think no, Bruce, we both you look know terrible. You could do more. I've been watching you for a while now, Bruce, and I can tell there's something darker in you. When you attacked Oswald, I could tell you enjoyed it. 
That wasn't me. If they keep dragged you off of him, that cobblepot punk would be dead. It was the drugs that, wasn't that Vicky it was gave me. Pump full of her drugs. Those just amplify what you're already feeling, what's already inside. Don't be ashamed. It's in your blood. I see a lot of your father in you. She probably mm. does too. No, I'm not. I'm not like my daddy. It's obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Why would my father have the Vales killed? I never said he killed the Vales. She was born in Arkham, Victoria Arkham. What? You so she was from that? Arkham Asylum. Or the Arkhams did not approve of what your dad and his partners were doing. Or she was they marked were from blow Arkham. The on the whole oh, thing, no. so your dad. Well, pop, pop. Her parents murdered, leaving her with an unquenchable thirst for vengeance. Surely you can relate. Um. Tragedy can drive people to do some pretty dark stuff. I'm not like her. I don't need vengeance. Really? Sounds to me like you've got more in common than you're willing to admit, Bruce. You and Vicky are both dark souls, and now you're heading on a collision course towards each other. That's gotta be fantastic! You see, I know what you really are. And that's why I really want to tell you where Vicky's moved her drugs, but you're not going to do anything stuck in here. Sorry. I'm okay. So, I vote we get you out. How hard can it be? You're Bruce Wayne. The Waynes always get what they want. All it would right. take Don't worry, is a phone call. Well, sure, but it's there's no stuffy. phone. I uh, assume I'm I can take care of that. <laughs> So no worries at all. But it's gonna come at a price. When I get out of here, you're gonna owe me a favor. Okay? Mm -hmm. Just favor. one. Yeah, I don't know what it is yet. Um. But what's one favor between friends? Sure, one favor that seems fair. Excellent. We'll have loads of fun. You'll see. I tell you what, I'm gonna make a distraction to get the guards away from that gate. The rest is up to you. <sighs> you make that phone call, and I promise I'll tell you how to find those missing drugs. Okay. Hey, Zaz! Hello, Zaz. What the hell do you want? Settle a bet. What happens if you make a tally mark before you kill someone? What are you talking about? No! No, 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 I don't match him. Oh, God, I don't match! You can fix that right now. My skin feels like it's itching. Burning! Need to... Need to get rid of it! Stop! Someone give me a sedative! Run, Brucey! Run! <laughs> <laughs> Use the phone. <laughs> <laughs> this game's glitchy. Bruce Wayne. Wayne? Aren't you supposed to be in Arkham Asylum? Listen, Gordon, I haven't lost my mind. I was drugged. The yes. same drug that children of Arkham used on Montoya and Harvey Dent. You yes. get me out of here, and I'm willing to testify. This might help our case. Come on, actually. Gordon. That makes three victims now, and Renee says she's got some new evidence. If you're willing to testify, I think I can get you out of there. Thanks. I have to go. <laughs> Hey, you're awesome, Gordon. <laughs> oh, Bruce. I have not had this much fun in ages. 
Let me tell you how to find Vicky's stash of missing drugs. Ask the fails. Fails. Quickly, come on. Good luck on the outside, Bruce. I just know you're gonna put on quite a show. Okay. Bye. I guess. Pretty grisly scene in there. Multiple stabbings. One of the orderlies had a finger bitten off. Doctor, I swear to you, I was not involved in any of this. Yes. We're going to look into it further I wasn't before involved I feel comfortable in making fight. a decision one way or the other. One moment. Seems you have a visitor. Hey, Alfred! Haven't seen you along in a long time. Alfred! Alfred! Ah, Bruce, thank heavens you're all right. You see, everything is in order. Signed this morning with Lieutenant Gordon of the GCPD. He is to be released into my care. I know it seems like using your power and influence is the best way to make this all go away. I haven't seen Alfred in a while. But it's while. just avoiding the problem. What happened with those men in your room? The riot with Zaz? You clearly need help, Bruce. He needs extensive oh evaluation. God. Treatment. I appreciate your concern, I just told doctor, you I, I wasn't you involved. I'm fine. You don't know that. Bruce. I got nothing to do with it. I'm the medical professional, and from everything I've observed, you're clearly in need of treatment. I'm afraid it's out of your hands now, Doctor. You have the paperwork. Let's go, Alfred. I will see you on the outside, Bruce. I can't wait! <laughs> What's that about? <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, I just can't believe that Lady Arkham was actually Vicky Vale this entire time. And all the while she was working with Cobblepot to try and bring me down. Did Lieutenant Gordon hear about this lead when he let you out? Not yet. Batman will handle this one first. Even during Batman's brief hiatus, Gotham has become that much more dangerous. And the public opinion on Bruce Wayne... Well, it certainly hasn't gotten <sighs> any okay. better. Yeah, well, Batman's that's why it's turn. Batman's turn now. <laughs> True, I suppose public opinion doesn't affect him much. Though, mm -hmm. if the people protesting to have you thrown back in Arkham get their way, that could put a damper on things. Man. Hello, Harvey. You should have stayed in the asylum where I put you. What do you want, Harvey? No. The streets of Gotham are a dangerous place for someone like you right now. Well, you'll figure that out. Eventually. But by then, it'll be too late. I'll be fine, Harvey. I can handle myself. I don't think you understand the danger you're in. Maybe you haven't heard. Oh yeah, I, I pretty much do understand. Obviously plotting some sort of attack, and people are scared. You just think panicking. I don't understand. I need to show them that my resolve hasn't weakened. That Gotham is still strong. So I gave them an enemy. You and your family's filthy corruption. The last thing I need is oh, you traipsing you. around Gotham. You're pathetic, Harvey. Not even mayor for a week, and already the pressure's gotten to you. No. I'm just a man who's done letting assholes like you run the world and take whatever they want. Can't let you keep running around scot-free, Bruce. It's the will of the people. You can spare me your will of the people, and screw crap, you, Harvey. Harvey. I know this is personal. You knew I was interested in Selena. What you did was a low blow, Bruce. 
A real man wouldn't have done that. A friend wouldn't have done that. She doesn't belong to you, Harvey. She can see whoever she wants. Exactly. Do not lecture me about Selena. Bruce? Bruce! We're done talking. Man. What's going on here? What? Well, well, well. Bruce Wayne. You really must have done something to piss the mayor off so much, hmm? <laughs> Maybe I'll get a bonus for this. Open the trunk. We're searching the car. If we find anything tying you to the children of Arkham, including drugs, weapons, or any other suspicious materials, mm -hmm. you will be taken into custody. Go ahead. I have nothing to hide. Doesn't sound like it. Besides, everyone's hiding something. Not everyone. Come on, what's the damn hold up? Get back to your car! Of course. Should've known. Go back to Arkham, you damn maniac! The hell? Careful, or you'll be the next cobble pot. Oh my god. Showing your face in public like this? What is your problem? Because you are making a big mistake right now. Bruce. Shut up, Alfred! I can handle this! Someone else heard that, right? This psycho just threatened me! Yeah, Those I drugs. Yeah, I the whole thing! They should lock you up! Oh, God, I... Alfred, I'm sorry. I don't... You'll be fine. We just yeah, need to the... get out of this mess. No, we're to run, dirtbag! Next one won't be a warning shot! All right, now the way I see yeah, it... Yeah, the drugs are making him rage. There are two ways we can do this, Bruce Wayne. Either I let these people at you and see how you handle mob justice, or you could make a little donation to me and my boys to help us stay well funded, hmm? And well armed? What do you say? Oh my god. They've got us blocked in. I can't back up. This is turning ugly, sir. What would you like to do? Hey, the mayor's gonna hear about this, and it ain't gonna make him happy. Hey, uh... he's the problem, not us! Back up! Back uh -huh. up! Bruce! Here. Pay it's them, everything I, I have. Okay. Sure, that'll work. So they can leave me alone. This isn't over. Yeah, sure. Just Take it up to City Hall. Can you leave me alone now, please? Please. We've done, uh... We've had... Deal with... Well, we dealt with enough, so... Glad to hear you got out of Arkham. See ya when you get back. Got some stuff we need to talk about. Okay, Selena. What do you mean you're leaving? Bruce, Harvey's clearly lost it. All over the news yelling about how you need to be brought to justice, throwing whoever he wants in jail. Not really interested in seeing what he has planned for me. Oh. I was supposed to be here laying low. Does this look like laying low to you? You don't need to worry about Harvey. I'll protect you from him. Don't write checks you can't cash. Don't you get it, Bruce? Harvey catching you in my apartment drove him completely around the bend. So you're saying you think his breakdown is our fault? I... Yeah? Don't get me wrong, Bruce. The night was a lot of fun, but... Not worth dying for. He's dangerous. You understand, don't you? I, uh... I guess. I understand. I don't like it, but I understand. Thank you. I appreciate that. But boy, are those puppy dog eyes breaking my heart right now. So where are you gonna go? I've got some other business I need to take care of. What other business? <clears throat> Look at yourself, Bruce. Uh, he You're looks in terrible. No shape to take on Harvey, or the children of Arkham, for that matter. Uh, get, get the drugs out of him. Of course. Or something. That's my car. See you around. Good luck See with ya. all of this. Thanks.
I kind of didn't remember this part. I half remembered and half didn't remember. Like I said, it had been a long time. And yeah, guys, um, my next stream will be, uh, The Walking Dead. Um, I'll be playing episode two of, uh, the third season, which is the new frontier. So, yeah. So, um, I'm pretty sure I will be streaming on Tuesday oh, for The Walking okay. Dead. Walking Dead to Tuesday. Computer. You're exhausted. Like, Taco Tuesday. The influence of Lady Arkham's drug may still be affecting you. Harvey is turning Gotham into a police state. Oswald has stolen my company, and the we need to find Vicky Tuesday. and the children of Arkham before they strike again. I can't just ignore it. You're in no condition to work. You absolutely must get some rest. <sighs> I don't have time for rest. You'll be no good to anyone if you can barely keep when your you feet up. When you get those drugs out of him. Bruce, you look... Awful. He's had a very long evening. You're right. You're we did. Right. Let's just focus on getting my head clear first. Bring up everything we know about Vicky Vell's drug. I'm on it. Hey, Lucius. If we can isolate the presence of the drug, I should be able to synthesize the antidote. Let's start with the DNA scan. If you didn't know, compared um, to your DNA on file in the back computer. The Dave and Noy who vo I'll voices uh, Lucius from the from Batman Telltale. Um, he also voices a uh, Lee from The Walking Dead. Okay. Here's my DNA before the incident. Alright. This is the refined sample of the drug taken from Officer Montoya after she killed Falcone. Okay. Seems that the drug attaches itself to specific proteins in the genome structure. If we can modify the drug's molecular structure, we should be able to create a counteragent. Once you've figured this out, we'll have a working antidote. Oh man, we I can cure others affected by the drug. No, I wish that were possible. It's based huh. on the individual's DNA. We'd have to sample and decode the genome structure for each and every person to make them a cure. We okay. don't have the time or resources for that. That's why we were lucky to have mine on file already. No. I forgot how to do this. Okay. Am I doing it right? We go. Okay. There we go. I haven't done this in a long it. time. So. So I'm kind of getting used to that kind of stuff. So this needs to be injected directly into the vein to work. I don't imagine it'll be much fun. That does the trick. It'll now work. it's starting to wear off a bit. Feel better already. So, what are we going to do now? First things first, I need to know what Vicky, Lady Arkham, has been up to while I've been away. Yes. Search for all children of Arkham recent activity. <laughs> the press is reporting that Vicky Vale is missing. She's not. Yes, and obviously, My the police God. have yet to find a body. She's woman, she's Lady Arkham. She's the, the children of Arkham. You, pretending to care, she betrayed you. Never trusted her. I never her. trusted her. It was always something off. Your yes, instincts uh, she are was... very rarely wrong, sir. 
She was, she was a very time, suspicious, getting down. getting into our business she all the time, me in our which is very annoying. She wanted me to feel what my father had done to all those people. Bruce, there were bigger plans than me, Alfred. Batman stopped her at the Skyrail station, and I can't believe that she isn't finding another way to use the drugs. Well, if that's true, she may be more dangerous than ever. I know, I know. I, uh met someone in Arkham who gave me a tip on how to find her. A tip? Do you really think you can trust someone in Arkham Asylum? Offense intended toward your recent time there, um. of course. He knew that Vicky yeah, Vale John was Doe. Lady Arkham. No one else has that information. I suppose that's not something we can ignore, trustworthy or not. He told me that if I want to know what she's planning, then I should visit her parents' house. Shouldn't be too tough to locate them. Got it. Bruce, before you head out, I've got something for you. Yeah? I call it a strobe grenade. Throw it at any surface and the ensuing light show will make you almost impossible to track. Perfect. Thank you, Lucius. Okay. Thank you. Least I can do after you invited me to come work in the Batcave with you. Oh yeah. Bruce. Yeah. I kind of yeah, forgot about that. If you do that. find Miss Vale, please be careful. Dun dun dun. dun. The Batmobile. Dun dun dun. dun. Stupid freaking ads. Okay. <laughs> yes, I just played that. I'm inside the veil house. Dun dun dun. <laughs> oh man. Wait, is that a Stan Lee uh, photo in the background? <laughs> Alfred, the veils are dead. One body confirmed, but there is a lot of blood. Alert Gordon. Yep, we'll do. so many blood. I don't know how this is connected to the drugs yet. Whatever they knew about uh, it, so much they blood. sure they kept quiet. Actually. Okay. Like, literally that pic, it looks like a uh, Stan Lee, but a younger version or something. Syringe. Seems she hasn't given up her old tricks. Is this the same drug? Yes. But this is several times yep. stronger than the dosage I received. Maybe she's escalating. This seems personal. Okay. There's an injection wound on her neck. Same kind Montoya and I both received, but this one's much worse. Oh. Okay. Her eyes are gone. Stabbed out. Her That's eyes are disturbing. Uh, gouged out or whatever. Hey, Anna, thank you for the host. I appreciate it. How are you doing today? Photo. Vicky's not in it. It shows the veils with another child in front of an industrial office. There's a logo on the building. It's good to see you. Large amounts of blood spatter across the walls. It's not steady like arterial spray. Someone was swinging wildly. Wait. There's a slight indentation where something bloody yeah, struck in the, the wall with send force. Send in those uh, emotes from Dan. <laughs> Something thrown. Nothing I can see. Okay. Piece of I hair. I found a lock of hair. Anything unique about it? It was cut at a downward angle. Probably with some force based on how clean the slice is. 
Sorry about that, it's my air conditioner. Okay. Knife. I'm doing good. That's good to hear. It's clean. I'm glad this that you're doing good. As a murder weapon. Then why was it and as you can the see, floor? we are playing a bat some Batman Telltale. We are playing at the fourth episode of season the first season. Alfred found Oh, and Mr. also, Bale. speaking of first season, um, no. I just found a um, disc of the second season, which is the enemy the within. So, um, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get that and uh, like we'll be able to uh, play it on stream. So, yeah. That makes me happy. The belt buckle is covered in blood. Before he was hung with the belt, Mr. Vale was beaten with it. Hmm. Okay. Is there anything else we can look at? Knife. Hair. It appears Mrs. Vale attempted to fight back with this knife, but only managed to slice through the attacker's hair. Okay. Same device, same oh, okay. drug. This okay. confirms I thought it was wrong. that Lady Arkham is the murderer. Like what? It shouldn't be wrong. Logo. The logos match. Mr. Vale owned an oil and heating company. Looking it up mm. now. Yes, he's got a sizable warehouse in the industrial district and a fleet of delivery trucks. Mm. And now Vicky's got it. Okay. The indentation matches the shape of the belt buckle. It must have impacted with the wall during the attack. What exactly happened in that house? I think I know. After we stopped her at the rail station, Vicky needed a place Sorry to hide her that. supply of drugs. Sorry if it's her bothering father's you trucks anything. and warehouse offered the perfect cover. To do that, she needed them out of the way. With Vicky Vale fully assuming her new identity on Lady Arkham. Seems like she didn't need the veils around to support her old one. Vicky showed up to attack her adopted parents, but only the mother was there at first. Miss Vale fought back and was able to slice off part of Vicky's hair. Vicky then subdued her with the same drug she used on me, but a much, much larger dose. Nearly lethal. She then removed the mother's eyes, indicating a deeply personal motivation. This was obviously some sort of vendetta. Sometime during this, Mr. Vale entered. Vicky attacked him with his own belt, striking with the Man. buckle until he was unconscious and killing her out. own uh, adoptive Finally, parents. Finally, she dragged him to the closet and hung him with the belt. The blood loss got him way before and the. And I hanging. wonder why was a uh, Vicky well, that's adopted? Horrific! She never acted out in such a violent way before. Why would she? Alfred, I think someone's still in the house, going to look for a heat signature. If anyone else is here, I'll find them. There's someone here, under the stairs, alive. It's the boy. It's the little boy in the photo. <laughs> hey, it's it's okay. okay. I'm not going to hurt you. Sir. Is everything all right? It's a kid, Alfred. The boy from the photo. Is he all right? Aside from the shock He's and a few fine. bruises, he seems okay. He might be able to tell me He's more just about what happened. He's uh, Possibly. But if that's the road you go down, please do it with caution. Hey. 
Hey, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be all right. It's okay. Something bad happened out here. I know it might be scary, but I need your help. Can you do that? Okay. I need you to tell me if you saw or heard anything. This is important. I... I heard someone say something. Something about drugs, fighting the police. I don't Vicky. Know who. I'm pretty sure Vicky said I don't know that. Who because I didn't see anything. I didn't see anything because I hid in here. Please don't send me to punishment. Calm down. It's okay, I won't. See, that it's does okay. help me. You're not in trouble. Thank you. You're not in trouble, little boy. Hey, what's your name, by the way? I've heard your name. Get down. Ah. ah! Well, hello, Batman. What a <laughs> pleasure to see you. Ten. Let yep. me guess. You're trying to figure Isn't out. Isn't that our drone? Figure out where the drugs are. Or something? Did I get it? Did he upgrade it? Pathetic. I've got these little back traps all over the city, but I should have known a good double murder would be what brought you out in the open. I wonder. Crap. No. Get him. Support him. Nice work, kid. <gasps> yeah, nice job. Oh no no. They're dead. Don't look. Don't look. I'm so sorry that I couldn't save your parents. You don't oh. know how sorry. It's just like a Bruce Wayne all over again. I won't when he was stop a little, until I catch the person kid. that did this. You're the kid who saved Batman. And no matter what happens, no matter where you go, that will always be true. Aww. And I will always owe you one. Yay. Oh my god. He was the only survivor. He's okay. He's not hurt. Come on. Let's get you out of here. He saved me. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, Dan. Well, the Welcome to the stream. Again? How are you doing? Why would they attack a family like the Vales? Because their daughter, Vicky, is Lady Arkham. She killed her own parents so she could use their company warehouse to stockpile the rest of her drugs. Vicky? Vicky Vale, the reporter? And so, who is the boy then? My guess is he's another foster child living with the veils. I'm he doing a ton of work right now, so I'm gonna be and the in and out of Can't chat, anything. but it's good to but see you. Like it's okay, Dan. It's okay, Dan. It's all right. And I am Thanks doing, I'm doing, I'm doing all right. I'm doing good. The warehouse is veil oil and heating. You should secure I'm doing a bit better than I was uh, years ago. I'll get on it right away. What about I'm you? Just, um, I'm just trying not to think about it that much. Lieutenant, what's going on here? Securing the crime scene. Oh my scene, god, five people. Not anymore, you're not. I'm taking over this investigation. I can't risk you allowing Batman to contaminate our crime scene again.
By the way, I think you might be wrong in the category. You think you want to be in Batman the Telltale series? What do you mean? Did I put the game wrong? And so your bat stunner just didn't work? That's right. I have a bad feeling it was no accident. If not for Lucius's strobe grenade, I'm not sure what I would have done. Lucius, meet me at the back computer. There's something I want to talk to you about. Be right there. Let's get yeah, a closer the look game at you. in the game category in you, in you're in is the wrong game. Hold on. No damage on the microfiber. Check that real quick. Adhesion regulation reads normal. EMP functionality is all in the green. It should have worked. Electricity conductor, everything looks functional. This doesn't make any sense. Sorry about that, I'm just trying to figure out what I got wrong for the category. This is strange. This microchip is emitting a low bandwidth receiving signal, but it shouldn't be. Oh, it just like the ones you shut down in the GCPD. It just says Batman. Something like that. But Lucius had his eyes on the Wayne tag that the children of Arkham breached. This is something different. I'm here. What's up? Take a look at this. God, someone's found a way to get past my security upgrades. Not just someone. Oswald Cobblepot. I am so oh, sorry, Chris. If only I'd been at Wayne Enterprises. Maybe there was something I could have done. Oh, what a mess. That sleaze cobblepot at the heart of it all. Cut yourself some slack, Lucius. There's no way you could have known. I certainly don't blame you for it. Well, I still feel a little guilty. Looks to me like he's introduced some sort of bug into your network. That's how he's making my equipment malfunction? For now, but if he keeps okay. it up, he could completely there we go. take control of your tech. Just saying that you that can would be, be seen catastrophic. with other Telltale people. Is there anything <laughs> you can do? I can try to work on That's your Lee, if I ever did hear him. Yes, um, the voice we'll actor who is, um, Dave Fennoy, who voices Lucius Fox, um, he also voices Lee. Cobblepot doesn't know uh, Lee to. and The Walking we Dead. risk losing the element of surprise. So yeah, the same voice, the voice, the possible. same voice actor. Good plan. It's just I'll an amazing actor. Right He's Thanks, so Lucius. talented. Uh, uh, Bruce, uh, Lucius, you're going to want to my, see this. <laughs> what oh is my it? god, seven viewers. <laughs> Reports of children of Arkham activity are down. But these efforts yeah, every time I hear cheap. Lucius uh, talk, um, I can hear Lee. I can uh, see That's Lee in my head. That's why I am formally seizing the Wayne estate. So the corrupt wealth like, of Gotham's Wee! elite <laughs> can go to the better purpose of protecting Gotham's common man. Mr. Wayne has 24 hours to evacuate his property and turn it over to the city. Or he will be removed. You, you can't let that egomaniac throw us oh, out on the street. My God. I have to talk to him. After what happened at the debate, Harvey probably isn't the biggest fan of Batman. On the other hand, perhaps Bruce yeah, Wayne probably can because, to him um, on a more personal I level. didn't save him. Harvey's behavior is unpredictable. Random. Who knows how he will react by the way. Oh my god. We have to go through that again? Oh my god. Be back. Okay. Okay, Anna. Um. Go as Batman or Bruce. Oh, uh, we've seen enough Bruce for a while. We'll just go as Batman. Tonight, Batman saves Bruce Wayne. Yes, about bloody time. Yeah, I think that's. 
I think that's the best option. Because um, we just talked to him on the phone earlier, and um, he said that we should have stayed in Arkham Asylum. Don't screw this up, Harvey. It was the right thing to do. Yeah, of course. Of course it was the right thing to do. I just can't... I just can't second-guess myself. We need to talk. We need to talk. <laughs> oh, Batman. What a surprise to see you on my roof. I'm always You've gone on too roofs. Far. Leave Wayne alone. Wayne? What was this about the whole seizing his assets thing? What are you gonna do? You gonna break my legs? Maybe. <laughs> or maybe you're just gonna make threats. Words out that you don't get violent unless you have to. If it comes to that. You think that even comes close uh, um, to what you let happen have, to my face? I don't think I've um, Funny. asked you this before, but this have you Wayne played this game before? Would be a little beneath you, Batman. After everything Bruce has done, why should I do anything for him? Uh. You're losing your mind, and everyone can see it, Dent. You want to save me? I protect everyone. Oh, is that so? Now Wayne is just another curve all this stupid city through my way. Hill and his goons, the Waynes, the children of Arkham. I'm finally starting to understand. To see just how Point sick trick. Gotham really is. To save Gotham, I need to do some bad before it gets better. Ready to go. Do it. What did what? you do? Our Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. Man, we lost a bunch of our own guys. The apartment next door. Jesus Christ. What? Oh, man. That blast What's was going way on? bigger than you said. We must have taken out a whole city block with it. We stopped the children of Arkham. That's all that matters. That's what a leader does. I feel like I should thank you. Seeing as you did give Gordon that tip. I don't care what your end goal was. Even one innocent life is too high a cost. Then you're thinking too small. I doubt the police would see it that way. The police? Oh, the smart ones already answered to me. Otherwise, well, I think Gordon is already a perfect example of what happens to the not-so-smart ones. Bet he wishes he had just handed over the location of the drug stockpile when I asked. What did you say about Gordon? Gotta go. Where is he? Getting what's coming to him. You're so full of big scary talk. If you want to save this city, this is how you have to do it. Tell me where he is. Now! <laughs> You're too late, Batman. By now, he's just another corpse in Crime Alley. Yep, time to go. Back off of Wayne, huh? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Let's take a ride, gentlemen. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell is this? Mayor Dent says you're getting in the way of protecting the city. Dent's got you brainwashed. Oh, no, we gotta save he's Gordon. Trying to help. The children of Arkham are out of control, and no one, no one is doing enough. Oh, go down. Batman. What a mess. Thank you. Save the thanks. 
and explain to me why I just yeah, watched half the city block go up in flames. Dent took out the warehouse with the drugs, the location that I gave to you. Are you accusing me of something, Batman? Just say it. Come on. Let's hear it. Calm down, Gordon. Uh, calm down, he says. Two of my own officers were just about to execute me. A whole department of rats, and you're pointing a finger at me. Tell me what you know. By the time I got back to the precinct, Dent already had the information. He strong-armed it out of Commissioner Grogan. I didn't even have time to scratch my ass before I got hauled out here. Dent's position makes him dangerous. He's persuasive, and he has power. Dent thinks that what he's doing is best for Gotham. Executions, martial law. I know. I always considered him my friend, but he's past saving. There's no world in which he manages to set this right. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I wish it hadn't come to this either. <laughs> he just walks right to him and says nothing. We have a lot of work to do. Got nothing to say. <laughs> Everything is such a goddamn mess. But you gotta start somewhere. The real threat on the streets is still the children of Arkham. They are what Dent is reacting to. And standing in the way of dealing with them, too. The precinct trusts you. The commissioner trusts you. Use that. Direct their focus. You can do it, Gordon. <sighs> yeah. Gotta handle this first, though. We will get through this, Jim. Yes. I'm glad we're on the same side. We're gonna win this fight. Hey, Batmobile time. Lucius, what's the situation? I, I figured out how he's causing the feedback loop. He's somehow connected a, a black box computer to your encrypted network. God, it's like a digital battering ram. If he keeps this up, he could smash through the Batcave firewalls at any minute. He'd have access to the Bat computer. That's not the worst of it, I'm afraid. Alfred? Mr. Dent is pulling up to the manor as we speak, and he's not alone. Already? Sir, are you all right? Penguin's hacking assaults are getting worse. At this rate, he'll have my tech compromised by the end of the night. Place he could be hacking me from is Wayne Enterprises. Well, I don't envy your position. Even Batman can't be in two places at once. Oh my god. Um, I haven't seen uh what you uh where you uh what you do in Wayne Enterprises in a while. So, um, the very first time I played this, I went to Wayne Enterprises. I never, I never went to Wayne Manor, but um. I'm. I won't go to uh, Wayne Enterprises, and then um, next time I'll go to uh, Wayne Manor. I need to stop Penguin. You go to the back. Yeah, and we've and seen sure enough of Harvey today. Let's uh, let's just stop Time Penguin. To go to work. We haven't seen him in a while. I'll see you later, Alfred. Oh, I'll, I'll save you. Big above. Ah! <laughs> Signal coming through, Lucius. Looks like it. I'll give you what support I can. But from here in the Batcave, I can only see what you can. So long as you can confirm Penguin's black box when we're in the lab. I can definitely do that. Just <laughs> be careful, Bruce. No telling what kind of security he's had installed. I will be careful, Lucius. Or Lee. <laughs> Get it? Because uh, he plays Lee in uh, The Walking Dead. Same actor. Get 
away from me. Yeah. Gotcha, Bo. Time to fire the new CEO. Yep. Time to get my chair back. Damn it! Damn it! Does anyone have him? Useless, you, you're all bloody useless. Not my picture. Hey, it's the Baron Deadman. Well, not a picture of my mommy and daddy. Pleasure to see your sour mug again. Glow while you can, Cobblepot. I'm taking you down. Mm, yeah, I don't think so. In fact, I think it's you who's gonna get beat by me. I'm pretty good in a fight, you know. Been in a few scuffles here and there. That's not happening. You're outmatched here. Give up. Oh, is that what you think? What, because of all those fancy gadgets? You know, I like your style, Batman. I really do. But you're really starting to be a pain in the ass. The children of Arkham are going to walk all over this city, and there isn't anyone who can stop us! Not even you! But this company, under my uh. expert stewardship, with the technology being developed, we could control nations. You and your plans are over, Penguin. You're going down. Wrong. You're going down, this is just the start. punk. You're going down, punk. I just said that. I you just said way. that. Stop was that. Stop that. Small. It was only tinkering around. So focus. <laughs> that was from Aliens in the Attic. At uh, one of my favorite um, movies. She vision. That's why she made sure I was put in charge of the company. Why wait? Oh, I see. It helps you plan things out ahead of time. Neat trick, though. Pretty flashy for someone who only wears black. How? Oh. Not just for fashion. It's very functional. Face it, Batman. You're outmatched. Without your tech, you're just a man in a pointy ear costume. You can't stop us. Watch oh, me. Oh, yeah. Bring it. Fight me. Come on, Batman! Show me what you got. Oh, I will. <laughs> It's almost done hacking your precious network. That's the device. A few more minutes. All your secrets are mine. I will stop you before that happens. Get out of my house. This is how it feels when you put on that suit. I like it. Oh, crap. You got my armor. Or whatever. Hey, welcome back, Anna. I am fighting the penguin right now. Ouch. Ow. Haven't you learned yet? I've shut you down. I'm the one with the toys now, bad. Oh yeah, not for long. That hurt. This is the start of a new legacy. And I'm afraid you don't have any place in it. Come on, Batman. Oh, man. Get those off. Oh, 
Watch out for the sledgehammer. It's done, Cobblepot. Your revolution is over. It started with you, and it ends with Lady Arkham. Oh, good luck. You'll never find her in time. Oh, I will. Where is she? You just don't what know. is she planning? The message is the same as it's ever been. We will open your eyes. The city's hypocrisy will be exposed. Tell me where to find her. Piss off. I'm not telling you anything. Um, when she's ready, she'll find you. You're nothing but a pawn to her. And you're a fool if you think otherwise. You don't get it, do you? I'm not a pawn. I'm a soldier. I die before I sell out the cause. Take him in jail. <laughs> Alfred, I'm coming for you. What the? Just cut me down, mate. Just tell him Wayne put up a fight. Oh, screw you, Harvey. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. <sighs> okay. So th that was a split decision promise joker a favor yes we did that and yes we did uh, make a phone call to get off Arkham most people did that um, my first time I played this um, I got involved with the fight between um, John Doe and um, Victor Zaz. So, um, this time I thought I would make a phone call because I think that's the best option. Okay. Um, that's a split decision as well. We paid off the enforcer at Harvey security checkpoint. Oh man, My, most people did go as Batman. Uh, when, uh, when we went to talk with Harvey. So, wow. Most people, uh, did, uh, go as Batman. Okay. Um, stop Harvey or Oswald. So, most people did, um, stop, um, the Penguin instead of Harvey. So, but it's still a split decision. Um, but we, of course, we gotta save Alfred, but, um, we also need our tech as well, so, uh, that's a pretty split decision there. Next time I'll, I'll, uh, 
I'll stop Harvey. <laughs> okay. No, next time on? Okay. Alright. That's fine. Okay. <clears throat> so that's gonna be it between you guys, and uh, let's do a raid. Where shall we raid to? is playing beyond two souls. Probably. Mm. Oh, you're welcome, Anna. Thank you for joining. Should we raid? <laughs> Sorry, you guys, I'm trying to find who to raid. I think we're going to uh, raid uh, this person who's playing Heavy Rain right now. It's their blind um, playthrough. That's gonna be after you guys, and uh, I'll see you guys on Tuesday for uh, The Walking Dead uh, Season 3, Episode 2. So, yeah. Um, my Instagram is Hannah Powers DVH Deviant. My Twitter is at Hannah the HP 600. And uh, my Twitch is Hannah Powers the HP 600, which is you on right now. And uh, my YouTube channel is Hannah Powers the. Hannah Power School's Deviant. <laughs> so go check that out. And um, let's do my outro. My name is Hannah. I am one of them. This is our story. And thank you guys for joining. And I'll see you guys on Tuesday for The Walking Dead, like I said. And I hope you guys have a good rest of your Saturday. Bye.